You know, with another bit of truth. Now today we go take a breakdown to the so-called Da Vinci. That so-called make this painting right here one of the most fam famous painting ever. <laughs> People just dumb. You understand the reason why it is the famous painting, the most famous painting? Because it was painted by a devil puppet. You understand? One that they wanted to put on on the masses. Your Da Vinci. Leonardo Da, da Vinci. Wow. We go get into this one and break it down. Let them sing this one praise. Cause all the people with brain know already. It's a The painting bite. Salvador Monday mm. by... Le there you go. The Salvador Monday is basically the so-called Jesus character. Of course it is. All in the Baphomet sign. Why would it different and got the X on and the damn chest? Is it Jesus character? Yes, look like a female with the long hair and holding the Baphomet sign right there. Everything that, every painting that you get from the so-called Da Vinci is satanic as you could see. All one eye symbol and sun rays. You get the point? It's sun worshippers right here. The Devil Network, CBS. Leonardo Da Vinci could fetch $100 million mm -hmm. at auction next month. Yes, $100 million at the auction. And it could be, it can be two things. Either it's a fucking hoax auction or people that dumb down about the Da Vinci. <laughs> you understand? If you're that dumb and you got that money, who in their right mind that got that much money <laughs> to buy a Da Vinci poster with it? You better wake your ass up, people. That's some dumb shit right there for the masses. And of course, when they keep lying to you and tell you that people buy these fucking dumb paintings for hundred millions, you're going to believe in it. It's garbage. 100% trash. Just one part of his rich legacy. Mm -hmm. rich Our legacy. cover story mm -hmm. is from Dr. John LaPook. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. They packed this gallery at the Louvre mm -hmm. in Paris. See, at the Louvre in Paris was satanic fucking place. Don't doubt me when I tell you. All they held in there is satanic monuments and statues. Just wake your ass up. At least six million people a mm -hmm. year. Six billion, six million people a year? <laughs> As you could see them in the orange shirt right there. Yes, they're high up. They're trying to get photo. They're trying to get video of it right there, people. You believe that? People just dumb. I told you, one fool make many. The government brainwash everybody that you see right here interested in this Da Vinci all the way in. For a glimpse at a superstar. Mm -hmm, a superstar. And a lot of people don't get it. It's the same man that painted it. It's him on it. You understand? Is the same fucking man, Da Vinci, paint himself as a woman right there because he is an androgynous being, 100% a satanic puppet. But a select few, mm -hmm. like author Walter Isaacson, actually appreciate the Mona Lisa mm -hmm. as art. Yes, I appreciate it as art. It ain't no damn art. It's just a trickery for the masses, a trickery by a devil puppet. The most famous painting in the world. And when you stand before the Louvre, mm -hmm. You and all what is it and who is it? Why would it be the most famous painting in the world? Who is it, people? Who the fuck is Mona Lisa? Who is Mona Lisa? Who is that person? Was it an actual person? I already told you what it is. It's the same Da Vinci, the person who painted, paint himself as a woman. Sudden realize mm -hmm. why. Mm -hmm. It's the why? most emotional painting. Mm -hmm. So she's it's been... An emotional painting. Celebrity for 500 years. Mm -hmm. Yes, been a celebrity for 500 years. People just dumb. They never get it. It's a dumb down shit with this Mona Lisa right here, a man in a drag right there in plain sight. There you we go. know a lot more mm -hmm. about the celebrity. There you go. Here go your Da Vinci right there. And I told you, he just paint himself with no beard on the face, just the long hair. The artist who painted mm -hmm. her than we do about Mona Lisa mm -hmm. herself. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Largely because her creator, Leonardo mm -hmm. da Vinci, mm -hmm. documented creator. his life's work in painstaking detail. Mm -hmm. Some 7,200 pages of scribbles and sketches survive. 72 by your number nine. Mm -hmm. You know, Leonardo may have been the person with the greatest amount of curiosity of any human who mm -hmm. ever existed. It's bullshit, people. He was working for the elites. You're not getting it. He's never different from the rest of the puppet that they put on. They're the one who put on the Da Vinci and the masses. And he would make lists mm -hmm. in his Watch them right here, people, with the library showing books. That means some smart people you're looking at is dumb people 
right there you can tell that they sell out watch the pyramid on the hand sign got diamonds on the tie Freemasonry. So things he wanted to know. Mm -hmm. Like how sun ray right there for the sun god and the one eye symbol in the middle. There you go. They walk on ice in Holland mm -hmm. or describe the tongue of the woodpecker. Mm -hmm. Now describe the tongue of the woodpecker. Wow, I told you people is just bullshit. They give to the regular people. That's all they give who you. Who in the world would wake up one morning and put on their to-do mm -hmm. list, describe the tongue of the woodpecker? Mm -hmm. What use is Bullshit. it? But there it is, mm -hmm. and over and over again, Leonardo is just putting down in his notebook things he's mm -hmm. curious about. Mm -hmm. Walter Isaacson's curiosity mm -hmm. has given us best-selling books wow. about how... Wow, best-selling books, and I told you people, they just give you some dumb puppets, and you take it and run. Who is this? The fucking Einstein, you believe in him also. Wow, I told you people, we're living in a dumb world. Everybody brainwashed. And if you try to wake him up, of course, you're going to be an enemy of those people. Of course, let the sleeping dogs lie. A lot of times you could just let the sleeping sleep, people. But Einstein and sleep. Apple Steve Jobs. And Apple Steve Jobs. I told you about him. I did the video and show you that he is a faker, a government operator right there. They pull aside, I put the fucking phone, and I told you already, the iPhone is no new fucking technology, okay? That's what they do. He never put it together. Is the elite front him up on the masses, make him a hero, of course. And his just-released biography mm -hmm. of Leonardo da Vinci, there you go. published by CBS's there you go. Simon... They're never gonna stop, people, and watch the da Vinci right there with the one Schuster eye. Schuster mm -hmm. will also be a film mm -hmm. starring another Leonardo. Bam! And there go, you go already. Another sodomite. You already know already this one is a sodomite in Hollywood. Yes, Leonardo DiCaprio, who born a female. 100% is born a female. Hollywood grow this one right here and feed it to the masses like food. Yes, he gonna play the Da Vinci. Dumb on. There's a story that uh, Leonardo DiCaprio has told, which is mm -hmm. that... When um, his mother was pregnant with him, mm -hmm. she was at the Uffizi. Mm -hmm. There's a wonderful annunciation. As you could see right here, people, this is what the Da Vinci paint. You see it? Somebody holding up the same Baphomet sign that you see the Jesus always holding. And of course, it's a fallen angel. Somebody with wing and a sun ray on the head. Wow. All devil people. You see this again? The other one got the sun ray on the head also. The same shit they paint with the Jesus on it. And don't worry about it. These are six worlds right here. And the sun ray in the middle also. They never miss just like you see. And the damn CBS right there Sunday. He's in there. They do the same thing. Looking at the painting. He mm -hmm. starts kicking. Mm -hmm. And mm -hmm. the dad says we're going to name him Leonardo. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Bullshit. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. DiCaprio's namesake was born out of wedlock in Florence in mm -hmm. 1452. Mm -hmm. With little formal schooling. He was apprenticed at age 14 to an mm -hmm. engineer and artist. And Leonardo's mm -hmm. skill and imagination... There you go, people. The Leonardo the, give you this right here. The Da Vinci give you this right here. Johnny Baptist baptizing who, who is this? Jesus. Wow. How could you baptize the Son of God? You the one who need baptism because you on earth living in sin. This one comes straight out of heaven. Dumb on, people. Bam. Flourished. Mm -hmm. Florence was very tolerant of a guy like Leonardo who was mm -hmm. left-handed and gay and mm -hmm. vegetarian. He was, he was left-handed and he was gay? <laughs> wow. I told you I never miss people. I told you the Leonardo is a sodomite. All of them. All of them people that they bring to you is just sodomites they bring to you in Sodom and Gomorrah. He's left-handed and gay and vegetarian mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. illegitimate. Mm -hmm. And of course he's vegetarian. But watch this people. Watch their list. The let the fucking puss out the bag right here. Watch they let out the cat. And it seems quite mm -hmm. a hunk. Leonardo was also incredibly good looking, mm -hmm. in very good shape, mm -hmm. extraordinarily athletic, mm -hmm. long curling mm -hmm. hair. And I mm -hmm. think that... Mm -hmm. As you could see, what you think this is right here, people? All the symbols and signs you get from the fucking Leonardo. You understand? There you go. This is somebody doing the cross sign right there. Yes, no doubt. And listen what they tell you it is. Listen. Very good shape, mm -hmm. extraordinarily athletic, mm -hmm. long curling mm -hmm. hair. Mm -hmm. And I think that Vitruvian man, the guy in the circle in the square spread mm -hmm. eagle, I think it's partly a self-portrait. 
You hear that? It's a self-portrait. The same thing I tell you about the fucking Mona Lisa. What I don't tell you, people. <laughs> you better wake your ass up. I never miss. He's the one who draw the Mona Lisa. It's him. He play a woman right there. It's a damn drag queen. And they tell you right there that he's gay. What's the difference? But perhaps mm -hmm. most of all, Leonardo was stunningly inventive. Mm -hmm. He makes Bullshit a portable bridge, which mm -hmm. you can just pop up mm -hmm. in the middle of a, a mm -hmm. battle if you have to cross a river. Mm -hmm. The Bullshit. Aspen Institute, the nonprofit think tank mm -hmm. Isaacson helped to shape. Think tank. <laughs> wow, I told you people, all dummies they give you. Yes, for smart people that make you dumb if you take them. Many years, mm -hmm. recently held a celebration of all things Leonardo on its mm -hmm. Colorado campus. There you go. Glider, mm -hmm. and he did it in Milan mm -hmm. off one. There you go. Sketches were transformed. Mm -hmm. Of course, this look like a damn bat wing with the number three right there at the tail. You see it? In the bottom of the wing, you see the number three carve out. Into in three-dimensional models. Mm -hmm. The famous helicopter. Mm -hmm. I think it was first designed for the theater because mm -hmm. he was doing all these amazing props, mm -hmm. having people fly and descend and ascend mm -hmm. on the stage. Mm -hmm. An underwater diving apparatus. Mm -hmm. He said bullshit. it would be a great way mm -hmm. to sort of attack ships. In mm -hmm. fact, he kept secret some of the details for fear that the enemies could mm -hmm. figure it out. But it's Leonardo's sketches that may set mm -hmm. him apart. Who is this that he drawing, people? Who is this woman that he putting on portrait? You okay, never get this it. is the big moment. Right? Watch him. He's the one who's doing it also. He also do the Illuminati sign. Right yeah, now here. so valuable that when curators at New York's Metropolitan Museum <laughs> agreed to give us a peek... I'm actually nervous. Oh, my goodness. Course, at first, they would... Every fucking fake where you can find it in a museum. Here we go. Of course, they're in a museum. No doubt about it. And I told you, don't trust nobody that all the sign right there. If they're giving you info, reject it. Bam. Only show us copies until Bullshit. we promise to limit exposure to our television lights. Mm -hmm. You know, when wow. I saw these for the first time, it's like, wow. oh my goodness, there's that. No, watch the hand sign. That's the triple sixes he holding right there for the mark of the beast. And yes, they're showing you pictures that never seen before. Yes, that drawn by the Da Vinci. Hand of the artist. Mm -hmm. And it's just Bullshit. as if he were making it in front of me. Oh, Every time you see it, there's mm -hmm. a new layer to appreciate. Mm -hmm. Here's the head of a man in profile. Mm-hmm. This is a design for a stage setting, mm -hmm. a bear walking, mm -hmm. and the head of the virgin. Wow, a head of a virgin? Wow, I told you people, they're doing the devil work on earth. Something's no happening here. Something's it. caught her eye. Mm -hmm. She has turned her head. Mm -hmm. It's a study for many paintings he would uh, do later, mm -hmm. but you realize that he didn't just love objects. Mm -hmm. He understands how human movements reflect the emotions of the mind. Mm -hmm. It's bullshit, people. That's all they put on their ears on you. The Da Vinci. Of course, you're never going to forget him. Of course, they give you statues and monuments of him. No doubt about it. You'll Only never one him. Leonardo painting is in the collection of an American museum. Mm -hmm. This portrait of Ginevra de Benci at the National Gallery of wow. Art in Washington. Wow. How did it help change Renaissance painting? Mm -hmm. Well, up until then, uh, Renaissance painting had mm -hmm. had sort of sharp lines. Mm -hmm. And Leonardo said that's not the way nature works. Mm -hmm. So there's a smokiness to the lines. But the mm -hmm. great thing about it's this... Bullshit, people. It's 100% garbage. No telling... How they create these fucking shit right here. No telling how they come by them. But it's not no Leonardo the the, the basically paint them. You understand? This don't really look like just a random painting from back in the days paint by Da Vinci. It don't look like that to me. Even the stringers here, get out of here. Picture, bullshit. You see a young Leonardo who's mm -hmm. on the path to painting the Mona Lisa. Mm -hmm. But this isn't the Mona Lisa. Mm -hmm. There's something else uniquely Da Vinci about mm -hmm. this portrait. Leonardo cared even about the parts mm -hmm. unseen. Watch the ribbon for Freemasonry. So he paints the back mm -hmm. of Ginevra Da Vinci. We realize he still has more to teach us. Mm -hmm. Leonardo mm -hmm. even taught himself anatomy with dozens of human dissections. Wow. He documented how the aorta. It's all bullshit, people. Like I don't tell you, they're sticking this ear on you. They call Da Vinci. All fucking fakers. Are you running down the painting? Are you one of them that chasing a Da Vinci painting and feel like it's important? All devil work like is valve in the heart works. Mm -hmm. Something researchers only mm -hmm. confirmed in recent years. Yes, he know all the heart work. Mm -hmm. That's right. And mm -hmm. then there's his knowledge of the eye. Bam. 
Of course, he got the knowledge about the fucking one eye. Because I told you who he worked for. The one eye God. 100%. All of them eat out that devil pot. And of course, they're falling He realized that the center, mm -hmm. when you're staring at something, you see mm -hmm. the detail. Mm -hmm. And if you're slightly off, it mm -hmm. goes to a different part of the mm -hmm. retina. The harder you look directly at the Mona Lisa's lips, mm -hmm. the more it looks like her lips of are here. turned down. Mm -hmm. But as your eyes wander, mm -hmm. she starts smiling at you. Mm -hmm. so it's bullshit, people. 100% crap. It's just a devil fucking painting. And of course, you've got no business just sitting there staring at that devil shit. Wow, I'm gone.